Hey guys, welcome, welcome back to the YouTube channel. Today we are going to be making fresh Nigerian okra soup. Um, the ingredients will be in the description down below if you want to follow up with the video. Um, so yeah, so you're going to boil your fish with water and onions before you start cooking in general. So yeah, let's cook. So for starting, we're going to add um, red oil into the pot and then we're going to add onions and just stir it together. We're going to let it fry for a little bit and then add our tomato paste so that, you know, it can have that extra redness to it or something like that. And um, after letting it fry, you're going to add shrimp. If you're if you don't like shrimp or you're allergic to shrimp, then you don't have to add it. You can add something else as a substitute for it. And then we're gonna add seasoning cubes inside and keep stirring. And that fish that you boiled at the beginning, you're going to add the water um, into the pot and let it um, boil for a little bit. And then you're gonna um, stir it. Um, after that, you're going to add your mushrooms inside. If you don't like mushrooms, you don't have to add it. It's your choice. It's your food. You don't have to add anything that we add in the video. And then you're going to add your crayfish mixed, I mean blended with dawa dawa and water. And then you're going to add your okra. Um, if you're going for a more like crunchy type thing, you don't have to add I mean, you can add like this much okra, but if you're going for like, you know, more watery, I don't know. But it's your choice to add as much as you want. And then we added the oziza leaves and then the fish. Um, yeah, so we added the fish like just so it could simmer a little bit. And then the food was pretty much done. And then we, you can pair it up with like... <laughs> you can pair it up with anything if you want. So, yeah. Thank you for watching. See you guys on the next video. Bye.